What up, YouTube? Before this video begins, I want to clarify some things on this video. This video is very weird. Um, it's not weird. I talk a lot. There's only like a few, like not even a minute or maybe a minute that I show the car. Um, the car being at the shop, I don't want to be there just recording and having the camera out while they're doing their thing and having customers and all that. I don't want to be there just walking around with a camera. So... I just show the car real quick. I don't talk much of it. I just talk about what I'm doing with the car and all. Then there's going to be another video after this, and it's going to be basically the same way. I talk a lot, and I just show the car like real quick. Right now, as we speak, the car's in the shop. The guy that's helping me with everything to do with the car just texts me right now. There's some things going on with it. I was hoping that it was going to be done today with the paint and all, but I guess not. There's some things that just came up, and it's annoying. I'm kind of frustrated right now having to deal with it, but it is what it is. I um, kind of wish that I just sold the car, or maybe just switched up the engine and sold the car as it was, messed up or whatever. Even if I only gained, even if I only got like a thousand or a thousand five hundred for the car, but it would have been out of my hands and I would have started a different build. But it is what it is. Um, I guess enjoy whatever I recorded and I'll try to upload a little bit more of what's going on after I release this video and the next video that should be released in about a day or two because um, there's not much edit to it because all I'm doing is talking but I'm not going to keep up more this time because I'm already two minutes into this just wanted to let you know about that enjoy whatever I record. Is this on? I forgot how to work this. What up, YouTube? What up, Lavish Empire? Damn, it's been a long time since I picked up a camera. It's been like, what, two, three months since my last upload? Damn, I've been slacking. Anyways, slacking-wise, I don't have nothing to record. I don't have much parts for cars to buy them. And I'm not working on my car all the time. It's not what I do. I have other things to do, but, but, my prelude is finally in the shop, so we're going to go over there right now, and we're going to see what's up, they still, I don't think they still have started on the car, I think it's still in the front, but it's been up there for like a week, I guess the parts still haven't got there, but right now I'm going to take it over there, and um, I'll let you know on the way there, what we're doing, so right now, I'm actually going to load up my wheels. I'm going to put them in the car, and we're going to go over there, check the car out. All right, let's go. Woo. The beauties. Oh, my God. Fucking shit. Oh. Got the wheels loaded up on my dash truck. Ready to go. All right, so... We're on our way to um, to the shop right now. Let's see, yeah, and all right. So right now in the shop, I'm rebuilding the engine, and um, I was gonna do it myself again, but then I was just like, you know what? Now it's too much to do, and I really don't have the time. And by the time I'm finished with like the engine and all, it's just gonna be, it's just gonna take too long. And I feel like just having the car right. I already have been trying to get this car right for so many years. And I just want, I just want to like, I just want a shop to do it and hopefully get it right. Cause with that car, I've always run into some problems. If it's like not one thing, it's another thing, or I fix one thing and I'm like, all right, we're good now, but no, something else like pops up. So took it to this place called Live Auto or live auto however they say it and um they quoted me and i said okay i've called so many different places and they they either say no they don't do engine rebuilds or they just do um engine swaps no rebuilds or i don't know something like that 
this one shop actually quoted me pretty good and they were going to give me like a whole bunch of upgraded parts and and uh to add more horsepower to the car which is really good the only problem was i had to take out the engine myself and i don't have a problem with that i can do it i already did it once but i just didn't feel like doing that and i was just like nah um they actually gave me a better price than where the car is right now because of like how much upgraded parts they were going to give me they're doing that um i bought i just ended up buying a new hood because they couldn't fix it because of the dent that it has in the front from an accident that i had like three years ago or something like that um i ended up getting a new rear bumper because it has like these cracks and they, the guy said even if when you sand it down it might end up showing up again who knows um but i just ended up buying the both used parts um i don't know what they he said they were in good condition i don't know if they're there yet or not um but i want to check them out once they get there and but he's gonna scuff them up i'm looking brand new and that's that i'm getting the car painted um it's pearl white but i'm gonna end up painting it uh just regular white because the wheels are white and I want it to just be all one color. I mean, the, those wheels, I'm not gonna have them forever. I know I'm gonna end up changing them. Like, I already, I'm already thinking of the ne next set. And like, maybe I'm just gonna drive on these wheels for about a year or so and then sell them and try buying these. Maybe go for like some CCWs or, um, there's this other company, I forget the name of it, but I don't know, I'm already thinking about the next set. But now I'm taking the, the kit. Also, I'm taking the kit for the size, the, the side skirts, and I'm taking the rear parts, and um, yeah, I think that's it. I'm going to ask them if they can check like the, the transmission to see if there's any parts that it needs, because it grinds on the third gear. If I shift in it too fast, I have to like ease into it. So I told him if he could just do the, the rebuild for that, but he told me that he would rather just see what parts that the transmission might need instead of doing the whole car or the whole transmission itself which it's a better which is better and um and yeah so right now i'm taking the wheels because when i lowered it the first time i don't know if i ever uploaded that vlog or not i might have lost the file for that but we were testing the um, the wheels one day and i lowered the car a little bit more as much as i could i was testing it with tahim and it didn't camber in like parts for the prelude you cannot find parts for the prelude like if you see most preludes my, probably the only difference they have from each and other prelude is probably wheels like that's the only thing or maybe a, a different front lip but everything else you'll see most of the preludes look the same um it's really hard to make a prelude look different than other preludes the only thing is that there's not much there's not many preludes out there if you go to car shoot car shows you might see like one prelude compared to civics like you will see civic like you see a different car another civic a different car another civic civic and so on so i'm taking the wheels because i have to we have to put them on and he's gonna bang out the the or pull the fenders and see how much he needs to pull for the car or for the wheels can clear the fenders and I can lower the car more and, and um, make it look more stance and the wheels were able to do a, a natural camber. All right, so I talked too much already. Let's check out the car. So this is how the car is currently sitting. Looks like they took this off, took the rear bumper off. 